Hey guys, it's Gameface here, and welcome to another squad builder. And uh, today I'm going to be doing a Tottenham Hotspur uh, squad builder. So, as you would expect, I'm going to have to have Hugo Loris um, as my goalkeeper. I did decide, however, to um, not make it a wide um, Tottenham team. I thought I'd keep all sort of central because they have a lot of central plays. They do have Aaron Lennon and uh, I've forgotten the left mid that they've got as well, but I decided that I'll go everything central really. Um, so the four at the back that I had was Danny Rose, uh, Vertonghen, Cabal and Kyle Walker. Uh, then in the centre defensive mids just in front uh, to kind of um, hopefully hold the defence and keep it strong, I had uh, Kapoe and um, Sandro. Now Kapoe I'm really happy with, he's such a fantastic player to say he's non-rare and he's really cheap. In front of them two I had um, Dembele and then I had two centre attacking mids in front of them and I was interested to, do, um, to try out Paulinho because I've never tried him out before and I was hoping that he could be quite good and then also uh, with Paulinho was Ericsson as well and obviously my striker had to be Soldado. Now this was the Tottenham team that I decided to go with and I actually do play one match. I was considering showing uh, two matches but then I thought the one match was enough uh, and you'll see why um, in this video because it really is a fantastic match. There's more, th it's double digits in goals, put it that way, in total goals that we go into double figures. Um, there's that many goals in this one game, it's unbelievable. Now I don't know what that tells you about the team, I don't know whether it tells you we're poor defensively or we're really good um, offensively or both, but um, really the team was absolutely fantastic. It was a lot better than my uh, previous team that I did, my silver uh, Premier League team so much better and I really would re recommend that team and I'm considering keeping it as well after uh, recording this video so do get into the game um, as quick as possible you'll see that I'm searching for an opponent there and I do come up against a guy called the Warriors and his team is fairly average I suppose there's no sort of standout players um, other than really maybe Fellaini that was pretty much it and obviously his goalkeeper was uh, Loris like mine uh, which is a bit strange and then we had um, an attack from him straight away um, in the 20th minute Remy scores quite a sweaty goal now it's the 20th minute they've already scored I was getting slightly worried um, that we weren't actually going to be able to score and we weren't going to be able to defend very well however that did change but it took some time to change um, and we did start the kickoff uh, fairly positive you know we were staying in their half a bit uh, a bit more anyway and Sandro was just getting used to uh, sitting in front of the defenders and everyone was just getting in the right positions and we started a bit of a decent build up play to see Cal Walker and Sandro really sort of starting to build up Kapoe who's one of my favourite players on the team takes a shot gets saved and we get a corner from it now that was a good bit of build up play that kind of helped us get the opportunity Paulinho puts the ball in obviously there's no one in the box because we've only got one striker that was the only downside and uh, then it gets um, taken away by their players um, we are very good at winning the ball back as a team because obviously we've got four defenders and two centre defensive mids so it does really work quite well. You see Paulinho um, Capoe tried a little ball over the top unfortunately uh, it didn't get to him and he would have been offside I think Sandro. Uh, Sandro seems to be pushing up quite a bit, I don't know if that's because he's got maybe a high offensive work rate, I'm not too sure. You'll see here Soldado on the volley, fantastic, it was a lovely little ball over the top. Soldado timed it perfectly and smacked it into the top right hand corner. A uh, brilliant goal in the 43rd minute, that got us level. Uh, I think the ball was from Kapoe, was it maybe? I'm not too sure. Uh, but fantastic ball over the top and a fantastic volley in the top right hand corner. And it's only one all at half time, even though I said it was going to be in total uh, double digits. Uh, just before half time though, Soldado, we had to get in front before half time. I wanted to really get in front, so I did go sweaty and pass it across uh, the box to Paulinho. Um, that got us in front for half time, that's what I was really trying to do, uh, get us in front and uh, hopefully get some more goals in the second half. Now, it didn't take long for them to go on the attack again, you see Valencia going through there and he gets saved initially really well, I'm thinking yes let's get this out and then Hernandez scores in the box uh, from roughly the penalty spot making it 2 all before half time, now they went and scored um, before half time meaning that we were going to be going into half time 2 all. So at that point I was a bit annoyed about that, I thought I might have been going into the second half winning. Obviously not, I knew it was going to be a tricky game, I've scored two goals in two minutes, so uh, that was pretty good. And then the game in total there was three goals in two minutes, which was pretty crazy. And then Soldado goes down the line here, cuts inside, uh, passes to Dembele, do a bit of a 1-2. Soldado, bit of a strange finish, but gets it in the bottom left hand corner, uh, making it 3-2 in the 50th minute. 
and we were already in the lead uh, five minutes into the second half. The finish though, I'm not too sure whether it was a good finish or not, it was a strange one, I don't know whether he missed kicked it or whether he was meant to do that, uh, but it was a, at least it was a goal, you know, a goal's a goal. You'll see that a minute later after we scored, um, it's now the 51st minute, De Bruyne goes and lobs Loris, uh, I think that's a bit of my issue, I like to bring the goalkeeper out quite a lot, and uh, that normally happens with me, I tend to get lobbed by things like that. Uh, and again they're attacking, Ashley Young on the volley gets saved by Hugo Loris, fantastic save from him and uh, goes out for a corner. So at this part, uh, this stage I was hoping not to concede from here because I am quite bad at defending corners. Fellaini gets the header and, and scoring in the 58th minute, that made it 4-3 to them and uh, they were in the lead again so I was hoping to have to keep on coming back um, from losing and uh, at the moment I was quite struggling to get on the attack so it took me a couple more minutes so Dada got the header though and made it 4-all uh, in the se uh, 67th minute um, so it was already 8 goals at this stage and we've still got uh, well over 20 minutes to go and um, yeah I was hoping that we could hopefully try and uh, go on to go win this game at 4-all now um, you'll see again they get on the ball uh, they're passing it around Valencia to Fellaini, Fellaini to Hernandez, and then out to Ashley Young. Ashley Young puts the ball in, it's Fellaini again with the header, and uh, he scored in the 76th minute, nine minutes later. So, um, yeah, like I say, Fellaini was going to play a big part in this game. Uh, he did seem to be pushing up really, uh, quite a lot. He's playing as a striker almost in that sort of role. And again, we're losing 5 4. Uh, we've been, I don't even think we've been in the lead. I can't remember the, whether we were winning at 2 2 1, were we? I think we might have been winning at 2 1. Uh, but at the moment we're 5-4, Dembele with the shot, uh, Soldado tries to get it, but Dembele manages to make it 5 all in the 85th minute. Now at this point I honestly just thought that that was going to be it, it was going to be 5 all. that, that was going to help, that was going to be how it was finishing. Um, but it didn't, it didn't finish 5 all, and we were going to push on for a hopeless 6th goal to go on and win the game. Obviously I had not been leading much in the match, but... We see Cal walk past it to Sandro, Sandro to Paulinho, ball over the top as usual, Soldado brings it down, hits the bar and then Sandro heads it in. Um, I was so happy that that happened because um, I thought Soldado had just completely missed that one and that it wasn't going to go in. So happy that Sandro got a headed goal as well, he just managed to uh, head it into an empty net pretty much and uh, Loris couldn't save that one. And that is how it finished, 6-5, fantastic game, really was one of the best games I've played in a while. And um, yeah, that is pretty much it guys, if you want me to do any particular teams, uh, put them in the description and uh, I will try and do them. I've got about 120 grand to spend I think now, uh, so let me know. If you have enjoyed this squad builder guys, then go leave a like and subscribe, that would really appreciate it. And uh, hopefully I'll see you next time, goodbye.